While volcanoes can be deadly and destructive, an eruption on Spain's Canary Islands is also proving to be educational, even schooling scientists. CBS's Ian Lee explains how. To study a volcano, scientists have to get dangerously close, all while keeping an eye out for falling lava bombs the size of watermelons as they try to nab the hot rock that's more than 1,300 degrees Fahrenheit. And it's been an exciting experience. It's been mind-blowing, literally, uh, to see many of these processes in action. They're taking the big risk, hoping to see big rewards, with answers to important questions like, how do these volcanic eruptions form, develop? And if you live on Spain's Canary Islands, where it's already destroyed thousands of homes, when will it end? We need to learn how we can protect the population. And this is where this eruption has become very useful. It teaches us some painful but important lessons. For months, the volcano has schooled scientists, giving them opportunities to use their cutting edge technology to observe it from the land, sea, air, and even outer space. But despite constant surveillance, we still really don't understand what's going on below the Earth's crust. We likely know more about the stars in the sky than what's happening under our feet, says this volcano expert. So scientists will continue to wear protective clothing and gas masks as they chase answers in the rivers of lava. Ian Lee, CBS News.